I wasn't going to do another video, especially since I don't have a song prepared to sing. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, but uh, this started really ticking me off. Um, basically, uh, the Marine Activist channel is a YouTube channel, which he was running a live feed. He's one of the people that are... Uh, Actually, I believe he's the one that started this whole hashtag occupied SEC 23, or at least one of them. And um, his um, he was going to do a live feed from uh, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And then uh, Smokey was also going to do a live feed. And at 11 a.m., the Marine Activist uh, channel was shadow banned or blocked. I mean, it literally was down. And, um, and so was Smokies. Just minutes ago, uh, both the channels have come back up. Um, but uh, the, the, uh, from what I'm hearing, they've tried blocking him several different times. Or YouTube is limiting his views, which is ridiculous. Uh, I watched it live happening on his channel. He went from 650 watching all the way down to 89 in about 20 seconds. And then, um, th then it went down to like 59, and then it, the picture just completely blacked out. Uh, Smokies was a sa similar. He had a, uh, like 600 and some odd people watching, and then all of a sudden that blacked out. But both of them do seem to be up right now. While those two were down, I noticed the Seminole Church YouTube channel had a live stream that is uh, actually... Uh, I don't believe that one went down. But there's some nefarious things going on when people are being blocked and, and live streams are going down and, uh, you know, it's just ridiculous. The has been complicit. The SEC has not right, This is the main act of this channel. Time. Let's back up the live stream. It is time to make the music. It is time for all of us to unite and stop the stream. Come on, sir, please, and trust this now. Do your job. Do your job. Even says right here, they tried shutting me down. <laughs> He's back up to 389 views, it looks like. Let's see what, what's going on with Smokey. Smokey's got 600 views there. Let's unmute him. They're following what we're doing. Oh, yeah. They will get around. Oh, absolutely. Right behind their desks. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. They know. Yeah. They know. Yeah. Absolutely. And believe me, and you know what? I want to make something clear. Just because we're here yelling at the SEC, it does not mean every single person inside that building is guilty of anything. In fact, it doesn't mean that any of them inside there are guilty of doing anything. It is their There's job one, to right. change. There's one that is guilty. There's but one. there is it is their job to change the things to make the guilty right. parties pay. They need to know about it. They need the exposure. Exactly. Now they have those two. Yes. We need they only whistleblower whistles. Absolutely. Oh, boy. See, the wind's starting to pick up. We're actually getting signs starting to blow around here. All right, so we got Smokey backed up. That's good. Um, Want to keep as much uh, much on this as possible. Um, Fox Business News at 2, 2 p.m. is going to have um, uh, the Marine Activist is going to be on there interviewing uh, and uh, talking about uh, the naked shares and about... Um, and, well, everything to do with MMTLP. I'm not sure if he's going to mention that by name. At this point, we have a lot of different um, companies that are involved in this, so I don't. I'm not positive if anyone's going to be named by uh, uh, anyone's going to be named by name by company name. But it doesn't matter. It's all a part of the same thing. Uh, it's one of the reason why some of the picks I've given you uh, a few days ago, which I did mention, they're short-term picks, although. And you got trapped in there a couple days after that, like I did. Well, not too bad. I mean, if I sell right now, I'd lose a little bit. But I don't want to lose a little bit because I do believe it's going back up um, on the, um, uh, what is that, the GNS. Uh, and then the other one is the, uh, uh, that doesn't matter right now. Uh, also, uh, you can call the SEC at 1-800-732-0330. And uh, put in your two cents and give them comments. There's also websites that you can go to. 
Um, yes, there's a much larger than normal hold at this particular time. Supposedly, if you go through the menu, I went through the menu, you know, <laughs> and um, you're going to wind up getting an answer machine, which there's no reason why you can't leave a comment on there, you know, about like, do your job, do your job, <laughs> as they've been chanting all morning. The bottom line is that the, um, like, like Finra's appeal uh, to Rosa right down there in Tampa, I mean, was ridiculous. I, I mean, they're acting like, we got immunity, we got immunity, as if they're not being held responsible for anything at any point, ever. And um, they their, their responses also make it out to sound like it's just her, or there's just a few complainers, or there's just a few unhappy people. And if you called FINRA, like I did last month, they're going to tell you the same thing. Oh, well, you shouldn't listen to them YouTubers. And, you know, uh, you know it, it, it's out of hand. It's out of control. The denial is unreal. It's almost like a certain political party I know. They just keep going on TV and lying about things. But people keep buying into it because mainstream media is selling you this narrative. And for some reason you want to buy it. Not you personally. <laughs> but those people that do buy into that. Not only they buy into it. If you say anything opposing their ideas or views, you're going to get a mouthful. Uh, nothing that will make any sense. There's no real arguments there. But... It is what it is. Oh, Syntex is on. Photo, photo lot number two. Nope. Hey! So you want to go over here? You guys got a, uh, do you want to take a camera yourself or just go live on here? You can... How dare the SEC turn Okay, away here you go. The youth so, America. basically we can take... So it's live right now. Uh, hey, that's Syntex and Terry. Let's see if I can Terry Yonkers. <laughs> uh-oh. 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 Don't tell me that live stream's going down. Th that's the reason why I got on here to begin with, is because these live streams keep going down. Let me see about the other ones. Yep. The Marine Activist right, channel uh, hopefully I didn't do a, is down again. Oh, wait I'll a minute. Hold it. Here you go. No, that was, uh, I was having to switch. Nope. That's the MMTLP rally. Uh, da, 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 I can, all right, that's the Seminole channel again that had, um, I saw Terry on there and I saw uh, Syntex. And uh, a few others earlier, uh, a lot of the uh, a lot of the YouTube tubers that we all know and love, <laughs> uh, they're they're there. And I would have been there if I could. I will mention it again. I have some health issues, but you know, I don't believe this will be the last rally. And hopefully, I'll be feeling better for the next. Um, but moving on. Yep, the Marine Activist Channel is down. Well. Smokey's went down for a second, but it's back up. I feel like I'm doing like a, a football play-by-play -play here. Yeah. Is that, is that All right. Space? Yep. Yeah. Let's see what's going on, on here. Up, How you doing, fam? Nice. We're all here. It's me. You got Smokey. You got Syntax. You got Terry. Will be fan. Quint Hamid. We got Lady, Lady Justice and Liberty. Here. We're doing it big, guys. We're doing it huge. Did you tell them about the SEC wouldn't let the kids in? Oh, no. no, I didn't. The kids tried to win in. They wouldn't let the kids in. Yeah. <laughs> I hope I'm aiming this right, and you can actually see what I'm talking about here. But yeah, there's Terry. There's Smokey. Oh, the SEC let them kids out the cold. That's unbelievable. Oh, my God. This is our future, guys. They turned our kids away. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, I just heard something that's disturbing, ladies and gentlemen. How dare the SEC turn away the youth of America? They wanted to come in and see what you wanted to do. Don't turn them away. That's what we're here fighting for. We're fighting for the children. We're fighting, fighting for, for the, the children. Teachers. How dare you push them? That's funny. I said something similar uh, just on one of my videos. Which is true, you know. This needs to be made right for our kids and our kids' kids and so on and so forth. I mean, we can't let this continue. The naked short selling that goes on is illegal as all hell. They act like it's not on, it's not going on, and it is going on, and we're not all idiots here. And then if you call the SEC and you finally do get to talk to someone, they're going to tell you, well, FINRA... And they'll, they'll they'll go ahead and push the 
you know, the blame and everything over to FINRA. And if you call FINRA, they're going to say, well, the SEC approved it. And, and, and it goes back and forth and back and forth. And, and nobody ever takes any accountability. Nobody ever accepts any responsibility. Uh, the hedge funds just hide, you know. And um, the, the naked short selling is just absolutely freaking ridiculous. Let's see what else we got here. It was, uh, hey, uh, they have the full movie, The Wall Street Conspiracy. All right, that's on YouTube. It's free. It's on YouTube. There's a part two of that that's coming out uh, down the rabbit hole. I think it's uh, going to be called the Wall Street Conspiracy movie down the rabbit hole. And then there's a, another. Um, there's a, a movie that's being written about this. Uh, there's all types of writers that are getting involved in this. And even if you're not an investor. Which maybe I should have said that at the beginning. This is, you know, so you might have paid attention. But you might be an investor down the road, especially if you're younger. And um, this is something that affects us all. There are so many good middle class income families out there that the only way that some of them invest is through their 401ks. You know, which is fine. They're pretty stable on the most part. But... God forbid you go in there and you start deciding you want to make your own investments. And then what happens is these um, hedge funds, they take the information off of social media. They pay attention to what's going on. And, and we start talking about something and then they immediately go in there when, when the prices start rising because we're buying more and more of something. And they slam it back down. That's what they just did with the GNS. 